Do you know that there are services that offers a box of pre-portioned food ingredients? Have you heard about the Away Meal Kits? Or have you ever tried any of the Away Meal Kit service? Let me show you a video regarding to that. Let's gain some insight first. Let's take a look. Okay, hi, Assalamualaikum and good day to Dr. Rasida and to everyone who is watching. My name is Ana Batrisha Binti Asman and in this video, I want to share about the restaurant's DIY Meal Kits Breakthrough Innovation Opportunities. So, what is DIY Meal Kits? It is a package of food that contains pre-portioned ingredients along with recipes for consumers to simply cook and serve at their own convenience. In other words, it is a single unit commodity item that contains pre-portioned food. It is purchasable in grocery as well as from the website. This meal kits benefits users by saving time on grocery shopping, meal preparation, monetary ingredients and reducing food waste as we were moving towards on the sustainability environment. To know it, the meal kits for do-it-yourself or DIY cooking are not a new feature or service in the market. According to the findings of Skalco 2019, when it was first introduced in Stockholm, Sweden by Kiki Thiander in 2007, the meal kits have grown in demand ever since to the point where there are now over 150 meal kits companies operating in the US alone. For example, like Blue Apron, Hello Fresh, and Sun Basket. The increased inclination for cooked meals among millennials is a major element driving market expansion. Hence, meal kits have sparked substantial change in the food and beverage business as food trends are always keep changing. However, as stated by Robinson Ogoho et al. 2022, since March 2020 when the COVID-19 hit, the pandemic has altered many of our everyday routines, including our buying and eating habits. And it has created new barriers and challenges in the food service industry, such as consumers' ability to dine out in restaurants and the perceived safety on dining experience, resulting in unexpected opportunities for certain sectors of the food service industry, such as chef produce home meal kits. As a result, many households were seen to cook home meals since the pandemic due to the fact that eating out was restricted during that moment and that situation has caused changes in consumer behaviour towards home cooking and choices of ingredients preference. Therefore, restaurant owners have innovated their existing or new products and services as one of the possible ways to maintain and sustain the business. Some of the restaurants in Malaysia such as Chef One Cafe, Fibay.co, My Burger Lab, and Awesome Canteen also has implemented their creative service innovation during the pandemic as a new strategic plan to generate more sales besides depending on customers to dine in. As you can see here, the global meal kit delivery service market was worth 15.21 US dollar billion in 2021 and it is predicted to increase at a compound annual growth rate of 17.4% from 2022 to 2023. Why is it so? This is because of the market's expansion among millennials are growing in demand for chef or home cooked meals. Besides, the current generation for Gen Y and Z are increasingly embracing and using the delivery service. As we all can see, there are many of home cooked videos being uploaded online and this phenomena has triggered the current generation to favour more on home cooked meals. Therefore, it is a great opportunity for many food service sectors to implement these services into their food business. Not to mention, this full meal kit service was predicted to boomingly generate sales around 64.4 billion US dollar by 2030, which is three times more than the revenue earned in 2021. 
This is due to its convenience. The service could offer the consumers with less meal planning, grocery shopping and cooking that suits their busy lifestyle. Of course, we all want to have satisfaction of healthy eating, fancy and tasty food for unique home dining experiences. Thus, these DIY meal kits are the solution to this demand. But what drives these trends to be innovation? So other than technology innovation, this DIY meal kits is one of the business model innovation in food service industry that should be highlighted. According to Landry 2020, business model is defined as a strategy or documents on how a company or organization provide value to its consumer, why the process through which an organization update its business model with a new and unique concept is referred to as business model innovation. For instance, in 1995, Amazon is known as the Earth's biggest bookstore and now a leader in cloud computing that delivers everything including the OMU kits. It's the same like we have in Malaysia which is Shopee, one of the online purchase platform. The main purpose of this business model innovation is to create new revenue streams by increasing the value of products and changing how they are delivered to customers. It was stated in the research by Norris et al. 2020 that restaurants the our meal kits is one of the approach for business model innovation to withstand an economic crisis like the COVID-19 pandemic. These meal kits serve as an alternative to take out and fast food. This service provides the convenience of having fresh proportion ingredients delivered straight to their house. So, these are some of the trends contribution to the innovation in food service industry. First, many restaurants were forced to close or cease operation as a result of the COVID-19 outbreak and the prolonged lockdown as they rely on dining revenues. When offering any new product or service, managers must consider the customer's perceived pricing. Thus, some of the restaurants have shifted their focus from traditional food ordering to DIY meal kits, allowing customers to recreate their favorite restaurant meals at home instead of dining out. Meal kit service were created to attract customers who desire a home-cooked meal without having to plan ahead of time or go to grocery shopping. It is also aids in the launch of new service and goods to attract new customers while keeping the current one because customers are more satisfied when products and services are improved through innovation. It is thought that a firm can succeed if it offers higher value to its customer than its peers. And service innovation have become more essential than product-based innovations. Meal kits as a shopping solution and food bundle that meet customer needs and time constraint with their convenience where it contains step-by-step -step guided, pre-measured materials and foods required to quickly prepare home-cooked meals including the fact sheets of the meal that provide individuals with the opportunity to prepare a healthy meal by following the given recipe as well as work with and become familiar with the ingredients and new cooking techniques. The meal kits have created a new business opportunity on overcome common challenges of cooking lessons such as planning and bringing people to classes, particularly during the lockdown. Hence, these meal kits were proposed as a solution to solve community needs since they are giving meals that would foster the development of food skills as their convenience and time preference. It also provides less preparation time since all the ingredients were already cleaned thoroughly and prepared and labelled accordingly and ready to be cooked. All you have to do is read the instruction and cook with the given ingredients with everything is digitalized. Now some instructions may have a QR code that they can scan and link to the video with related food preparation technique and method which may enhance the convenience access and it advertently we have leveled up our cooking skills too. Moving on to the SWOT analysis of the DRMA kits. The SWOT analysis consists of four elements. Two are the internal factors which is strength and weakness and the other two are the external factors, opportunities and threats. This indicates a framework to in identify and prioritize their business goals. Starting with the strengths, the DOA meal kits provide us with the fresh ingredients every time we order them. Secondly, they ensure the ingredients remain fresh throughout the delivery period that they also have used innovative Packaging such as dry ice or redesign the box to separate the perishable and non-perishable food items. It is pre-portioned ingredients make it easier for us as a customer to cook 
without having to wonder how much to put the spices for example in a cooking and lastly it is available through the flexible subscription based service from online purchasing we can choose to subscribe the service for either one month or just a week for the weaknesses since it takes a lot of effort to prepare a box of diy meal kits however it slightly costs a bit expensive to some you know like they have to take into account all the supply chain from the production to customers beside it also might cause high packaging wastage nevertheless the company could invest on eco-friendly or reusable packaging to reduce this matter but of course it will cost more for the price at the same time customer might have to expect some delay in delivering the milk kits especially during the peak hours this also might cause the customer satisfaction on delivery time to decline as for the opportunities the away milk kits could reformulate their menu and provide more variety for the customer to choose this could excite them more to try and different dishes as mentioned before this service innovation provides us the convenience of time especially for housewife working people and others with busy lifestyle we also could elevate our cooking skill by following the step-by-step -step recipe provided in the diy meal kits and of course it provides us with more healthier food as we were more aware on how much we have to add that certain items for example salt, sugar, butter, oil and others in our cooking however there are some threats that need to be concerned on which is the competitors of course with the emerging trends and demand on the ready to eat meals or RTE it has caused a big competition in the market for DIY meal kits because customer could buy the RTE meal with a lot more affordable price other than that food safety also has become the concern and a big deal to customer as the meal kits are packed with fresh and perishable food which they need to be stored or used at the associate temperature and time lastly the purchase intention of customers might be on and off due to the changes in customer preference by time thus it could affect the DIY meal kits marketability and buying behavior in the future however there are still some challenges that could be addressed in the future even though these diy meal kits have given numerous benefits to the customer and food service sectors itself although meal kits frequently advertise their affordability claiming that they are less expensive than similar restaurant meals nonetheless when compared to buying groceries and doing the prep work that cost comparison does not withstand the convenience of meal kits can be costly if they are used to replace traditional grocery shopping and cooking every day it does also produce more packaging waste since all of the ingredients are separately packed and labeled the shipping box also contain padding or insulation as well as ice pack or other cooling materials to retain the temperature and freshness of the ingredients throughout the delivery time as a result a lot of packing is produced even though the majority of packaging is recyclable there are still a substantial number of materials involved therefore i would like to highlight some insight here are a few recommendations of innovation that could be improved in the diy make it service first the manufacturer of diy meal kit should emphasize the guideline of storing and cooking the ingredients of the meal kit because misguided storing routines might be the source for food waste as the ingredients have lost their freshness during preparation second the portion size for the meal kit should be applicable and tailored to most of household needs to reduce leftovers which have the tendency to become a food waste at the end of the day third to use more conventional storing methods such as installing conventional ice packet that made from water instead of harmful dry ice at least the ice packet could be reused and empty lastly to keep new products or services priced in line with their customers perception and the value delivered this is because customers may switch to other companies that offer the same qualities if the product or service is overvalued and comparison to their perceived pricing in conclusion not all innovative approaches are suitable for every organization or food establishment in food service sector these meal kits have provided restaurants with new methods to earn sales satisfy customers and remain faithful to their brand to summarize in order to enforce any innovation in the organization it must first understand their unique business nature when 
choosing what tactics work best for them. So that's 15 minutes from me. I'm Anna Batrusha Binti Asman and thank you for watching. Bye.